Welcome back, everyone, to another edition of our Cereal Box Game Series, where we take a look together at the artwork on a cereal box, and then we flip the box over and we complete the game on the back of the box. And today we have Kroger Cinnamon Swirls, sweetened whole wheat rice cereal with cinnamon. And they have a picture of a bowl of the cinnamon swirls. And I have an actual bowl of this cereal in real life so you can take a look at it in case you've never seen it before. Let me get a piece out. And you'll see the little cinnamon swirls on them. And this is made to be similar to, it's Kroger's version of General Mills Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And on our box, we have our cereal pals. We have the bear, the zebra, the cat, and the bunny. And what's special on this box is they invite us here to, in, to meet in person, not really, uh, one of our cereal pals. And we learn that the zebra's name is Wiley Zebra. And he says, run, hop, skip, jump, dance, swing, and slide. I just love to play, play, play. I'll hide, you seek, or you hide and I seek. I don't care as long as we're having fun. Come on. And let's flip our box over. And we see like a little um, a circus scene. Because there's kind of a circus tent up here. Kind of. And we see our zebra. And he is on a, a trapeze. And our cat is kind of in a swirly basket. And they're both observing or maybe bringing more cereal to this platform where there is a spinning piece of our cinnamon swirl cereal. And isn't that cute? Now we can do our puzzle, which is word swirl. The cereal pals are telling fun jokes. Unscramble the words below and use the circled letters to discover the answer to the joke. And we see six scrambled words. And then at the bottom, we have the joke, which is what do cows eat for breakfast? And there are eight little circles where we need to find the letters. And that will reveal our answer to what do cows eat for breakfast. So some of you might be able to just look at these words and unscramble them in your head to make our words. And all of these words have to do with cinnamon swirl cereal or just eating cereal in general. But for those of us that can't just figure it out in our heads, I have made a little visual aid here. Let's scoot us down a little bit. And I've cut out letters and I tried to make them look like the cereal. I just made them out of cardboard and I've made the exact same letter combinations but with our squares and they make kind of a nice noise when you handle them. So our first word, we are going to take a look at it. Can we figure out a word that it has something to do with eating cereal? Let's see. We could make sat. No. We can make, oh, I think I see a word. Do you see it? It has something to do with eating cereal. Tasty. Well, cereal certainly is tasty, isn't it? And I'm just going to put these answers that I've created on top of our box because these are very glossy and they're hard to write on. So there's our word tasty. And we see the S and the T are part of our solution for our joke. And I'm going to put those aside and we're going to move on to the next scrambly word. And this one is pretty easy. And it's pretty easy because the end letter and the beginning letter are in the correct spot. Can you figure it out? It is serious. We see that the 
the letters we need in this particular word for our solution are the two E's. So let's set those aside. See, those are the ones that were circled. Okay. Now we're going to move on to the next word, scramble word. Now, I see this word on this box already. Do you see it up here? Swirl. S W I R L. Because this is, after all, cinnamon swirl cereal, right? So let's get our our piece of paper and what whoops, what letter is circled in this word? word as part of our solution. It's the R. So let's set that aside. We're going to find the solution to what do cows eat for breakfast. Okay, let's go to our fourth word. Now we're on the next line. And what I think is funny about this particular combination of words is it can actually be there are actually two words in there, isn't it? Be, sit, which really makes no sense. And, of course, it doesn't have anything to do with cereal. But I just thought it was funny that there are two words right off the bat that you can see in there uh, in the scramble word. Sometimes that happens when you're doing a word scramble. But maybe the S is a clue. And it's a plural word, bits. No, I think that it's bites. I think that it's bites. So let's put that on there. And what letter? It's the E. That's the letter that goes in our solution. I'm going to set it aside. A solution to our joke. What do cows eat for breakfast? And then let's move on to our next word, our next scramble word. It's a long one, but again, they have given us the first letter and the last letter of this particular word, and it's kind of easy. It's a hard word to spell, though, in real life, but I think it's sin, sin, Oh, man, cinnamon. Is that how you spell it? No, it's sin. Ah, man. Huh, that's a hard word to spell. Cinnamon. Cinnamon. It's <laughs> a long word, huh? We got there. We, we figured it out. We should have known that that was probably going to be one of the words. And that was the longest one. And it stuck out um, pretty prominently. So let's put our, salute, our answer there with our piece of paper. Cinnamon. Cinnamon. And the A is circled. So let's take our A out and put it over here. I have all of our solution letters in a little box. I will show it to you in one second because we're almost done. Now, let's do our last little word here. Little four-letter word. K-L-M-I. Can you figure it out? This is our last one. And then we're going to look at our letters that made our solution. What do you put in cereal? Well put in milk usually if you have milk or if you like milk or if you can drink milk milk am I okay so there's our solution to that let's try to get it straight and we see that the L is circled on that one okay now here's the big reveal what do cows eat for breakfast I have put all of our solution, all the things that were circled, in a box here. And I'm going to show it to you 
Let me move them so you can see all of them. All of the uh, letters that we used as we went through our word search and solved our puzzles. This is what it made. What do cows eat for breakfast? Stereo. A steer is a kind of cow. It is a male cow. And then they put E-A-L at the end, like cereal, like the word cereal. So what do cows eat for breakfast? Stereo. Well, let's put that on the bottom. And there's our completed game. And I thank you very much for playing with me today. And I would love to come back another day and play another game with you. This one was kind of a, a longer game for a Kroger box of cereal. They're usually pretty simple. And I am so glad that you could spend time with me today. And I will see you soon. Bye.